What's up guys, today I'll be showing you how to model the Psych Engine and I hope you guys find it as much fun as I do as this is something I do on my daily basis. So, let's just get right into it. Okay, so what you're going to want to do is get to the Psych Engine wiki and you're going to need to scroll down Lua, a Lua script API example script under this. You will see something saying um, example of a custom stage. Okay, copy of week one. So just click it, it should download something. Okay, um, then I can go to my downloads. Go back to the Psych Engine as well. Go to mods. I'm just going to build it in here. Stages. I'm just going to drag it in here. You don't have to. You can unzip it and then do that. And you can do something like seven. You can use something like seven zip, or like the one, or the one I'm using, ultra zip. Should be fine as long as you get it unzipped. So yeah. So now, now that we have our stages, we can open them. So now that we have our coding program open, you can just use Notepad. Or you could download Visual Studio's link down to that. There's also going to be a link to the Psych Engine wiki in the, in the description below. And this is an example stage of the original stage of week one. So well, we're not actually going to need the stage lights. Yeah. We're not going to need the stage lights. We, you can just delete all of this. Which means you can also delete all of this. If you're just gonna make um, make it on size, you don't need this. And if I were you, I would just do it the way I'm doing right now, and just keep it to, to the original size of the stage as it is way easier to do as a beginner. So yeah, this is all you need for the meantime. So now what we need to do is get our stuff. So we can just go into assets, images, then go all the way down. No, not images. I am an idiot. Um, I'm in shared and then images. So then what all you're going to need to take is the stage back. Copy mods and then put it into images. So now you're going to need to get a um, painting app or drawing app. I'm using this one, Critter, it's free, link in the description for it. So all you're going to want to do is copy into the program. Super easy. Then you're, you, all you need to do is draw your own stage. I'm going to start with a sky and stuff like that. So um, paint bucket, just get a blue and boom sky so now i'm just going to draw some clouds i'm probably just going to draw two or three yeah two is fine and just a cheeky one um just fill them in if you want i'm just going to add a sun because who doesn't like the sun So, yeah, this is going to be the back of my stage. It's good. It's simple. So all you're going to do is need to save it back into here. So yeah, now we have our stage back. So I will just use the same one as I already set it as that. Um, then I'm going to need to get a grass color. and just draw some grass you don't have to make grass you can just do whatever I'm just gonna I sometimes do drawing so I know exactly how to do stuff like this anyways so now if our stage is done we can just see it here it's perfect but I'm just going to add a little bit of detail and I'll catch you back in a bit. 
Okay, so I've added a little bit of detail. What you're going to want to do is just save this as your stage front. So instead of naming it stage back, name it stage front. Boom. That's our stage. Oh. Well, that's my recording software, OBS. If you want, I'll put a link in the description because that's the one I'm using. Um, so yeah, everything's here now. What I'm going to do is just get the song Dad Battle, put it in here. I'm going to show you how to change characters in this video as well. And just just do easy stuff like this. Uh, okay, just get the data for Dad Battle. Boom, boom. Songs, Dad Battle. Perfect. So yeah, now that we have this, all I'm going to do is get a copy of the tutorial no, of week one. Then go to mods, put in weeks. I'm going to show you what to do with it. So once you have the um, week one open, I'm just going to delete these because I don't really need that. So yeah, that's all I need to do. I'm just going to rename it to test because why not and now I'm going to show you what it's going to look like in game okay so here is that battle and my stage is going to be on it so let's just check it out and see how it is so as you can see it works well it looks good it works what more could you ask for? So this is probably gonna be it for this video as I showed you how to make a stage and that's already quite a bit. So I am going to see you in the next one when I will be showing you how to make .json files for the characters and um, also how to implement like more songs, custom songs, and then I will also be showing you how to like have scripts, stage built in scripts, and just scripts. So, see you in the next one.